read by A.B. Rockwell. Right. We had the festival in 2019 with her beautiful short film Feathers, and we're so thrilled she's returned with her amazing feature debut. Um, 1001 is also an alum of the film, feature film program Screenwriters and Directors Lab. So it's a project that is very dear to our hearts that we are still astonished with the final result. It's a film that we found profoundly emotional, a film that made us contemplate the meaning of family. We absolutely fell in love with its audacious, free-spirited protagonist. It's just a story we're so excited to share at Sundance. Please join me in welcoming to the stage the writer and director of 1001, A.B. Rockwell. Before them, I had to go through. 
um, you know, no obstacles like gentrification. Not get you to work. It's just, you know, so devastating. And that was a huge reason why I'm just so urgent to me. And, you know, for the black moms <laughs> and matriarchs like my mom, you know, how hard they had to fight. Um, just want to thank them, you know. Um, I feel like it's exciting. <laughs> In society and even within our own community, especially like in cities where women are just so invisible and misunderstood, and it was just so important for me that you know I tell their story as best as I could, and you know just kind of try to be a voice for them, and hopefully let people into their lives a little bit, and hopefully understand them a lot better, and, and celebrate them.
And I feel like I live my whole life. And I, I'm, a, I'm a cinephile. Like, I love cinema. I love movies. And the fact that I've never, it's not even about representation so much. It's more, more like I saw me and my mama up there. You feel what I'm saying? And I love movies and I've never seen that in my life. You know what I'm saying? I'm getting chills and talking right now because you need that. You know what I'm saying? And your, your, your commitment, your resilience, your discipline, um, your, your, your creative mind is just, um, it's hard to make movies. You know what I'm saying? You know what I'm saying? We got, we got a crazy shoot, man, but for this to be your first movie, stop playing with it. I feel, like, I feel like, you know, in 2023, like, you know what I'm saying, for you to be a part of, you know, making the palette wider for audiences, yeah. making them be able to, like, digest something that's different, that's fresh, that's new, um, and specifically that's us, yeah. you feel me, yeah. you know what I'm saying, so they, so they can feel some of this, you feel what I'm saying, because there's so many people that go through this, you know what I'm saying, um, and this, this plight, this struggle is not nothing that is, um, it's not nothing that's lost on, you know, the world. And for you to shed light on it and acknowledge us and show us, you know, our light of grace, it's just, thank you. I'm proud um, for the gratitude. Um, thank you, Tiana, for being my dance partner, dancing with me. You know what I'm saying? Um, your, your fierce, like, just heart. Um, and I, I don't feel like people give you your flowers the way they should. You know what I'm saying? So for all these people, I'm giving you the flowers. Come on to Will, come on to Will, you know what I'm saying, being the light is dark, um, I know I'm talking about it a long time, but I'm going to you know what I'm saying, but um, just, just be, you being my dad's partner too, it's like, you know, being raised by the father is so important that, you know, the community takes a village to raise a child, and you embody the brilliance of what it looked like when the community step in, when the OG step in, when Hunk step in, you know what I'm saying? Somebody that's not even your father taking that role, um, especially for black boys growing up in America, I feel like um, it's beyond important. Um, and just the prose, the narrative prose that A.B. brilliantly, you know, wrote, it's like, yeah, he's not my father, but, you know, he put it on his back, you know what I'm saying? And you invite that, you know, with brilliance, you know what I'm saying? So, thank you. <laughs> I enjoy being with everyone and I I enjoyed my father well and I enjoyed him being with me and I I enjoyed when we were when we were when we were on that scene, that walking scene. It was a nice scene. This is Eric from MyOnCinema.com. If you want to support us, subscribe below. For more reviews, interviews, film festival coverage from Sundance, Cannes, Toronto, you want to check out these guys on this side. <laughs>